Hey guys, in this video we have some data entry work from home jobs hiring right now at a company I've covered before but for different jobs. This is a company called Forward which is at goforward.com. This is a healthcare company that is kind of known for long-term health and combining the best technology with some of the best doctors. And when you go here, when you go to their job section here, so if you just go down to About Us and then go to Careers, and then you go to See Openings, you can find that they're hiring a lot, mostly in the United States. When you go to All Locations, you have a couple of options here. So you can go to either United States or Remote. For whatever reason, they kind of separate them. So when you go to United States, these are also remote jobs, but sometimes they'll put United States instead of remote, and then they'll put remote in the job title. So for this one, you wanna go for the United States and then go and look for medical scribe jobs. Medical scribes are being hired right now, and this is a job that a lot of times would be done in office, but some companies will let you do them remotely. So for instance, uh, Scribe America is another company that comes to mind, but they pay a lot less. Medical Scribe at Forward, basically what you're going to do is data entry for doctors. You're going to log a lot of the information from a doctor's visit or information about a patient into a database. So here for this particular job, what you'll do is drive the technology behind a completely new primary care experience. They've traded in notepads and keyboards for human conversation and real-time collaboration between doctor and patient. Generate comprehensive medical records to optimize doctor time and enable robust 24-7 care for members. So in other words, you're going to deal with medical records, put that into the database so that the doctor can basically focus on each patient and not have to do a bunch of data entry on top of figuring out what's wrong with the patient. Gain valuable clinical experience working alongside world-class doctors and delivering patient-centered, comprehensive primary care services in a concierge-style model. And then you'll also have the flexibility to work remotely from the comfort of your own home. So who you are, what they're looking for in a candidate is someone who's responsible, who will take ownership of work. You operate with a high level of ownership, confidentiality, and attention to detail. You're tech savvy. You have strong technology intuition with exceptional typing speed and accuracy. Now I would recommend that you check your word permit typing speed at a place like typingtest.com. You can do it for free here. You can also do it on other sites as well. This one, they have games, they have ways for you to train, and they have just a test that you can take um, that are you know different times, different ranges, different types of text, and basically it allows you to figure out where you're at. So a lot of these types of jobs do want you to have a certain word per minute typing speed, although I don't think they say specifically what they're requiring for your typing speed. Constantly improving is another thing they want. You're equipped to pick up new skills, tools, and operational processes and relentlessly competitive to improve performance with them. You're reliable. You have a track record of met SLAs or quotas and great follow through on tasks. Calm under pressure. When the pressure to perform increases, you bring a calm head and a positive attitude. You're passionate about healthcare and helping people. Educational or professional experience in Healthcare, medicine, and life sciences is a big plus, but it's not necessarily required. You're articulate, you have excellent written and verbal communication skills, and you're looking to work around 20 plus hours per week. So you will need a self-provided PC with Windows OS. Mac OS is not supported, so keep that in mind as well. You have a wired or Wi-Fi connectivity. That's nice that they actually allow you to use Wi-Fi here. Many jobs don't. Five Mbps, download, Upload speed, 3 Mbps minimum, so very easy to meet those requirements. A mobile device, you'll need to install a few programs on a personal phone or tablet for authentication purposes. It should be running Android iOS 8 Plus or iOS 12 Plus. And then they talk about your display options, processor, memory, operating system, and browser. All of these are fairly basic, and if you do any research on computers, these are just kind of cheap computers that can meet these requirements. So as far as other things, they'll just tell you a little bit about how they're an equal opportunity employer and all of that. And then you can apply from here. So you can apply with LinkedIn or your resume and just kind of fill out this form here. As far as other remote jobs, they have uh, some telemedicine physicians, remote care coordinators, which are basically customer support. And they usually have some other jobs as well, like 
like sales related jobs where you are doing uh, sales like you're selling memberships to people and things like that. Now as far as salary for this particular job at Forward, if you scroll down a little bit uh, and then look at hourly pay, which I always recommend doing for especially for part time, you can see that a medical scribe based on 40 people who submit salaries is typically around $20 an hour here, which is actually above some other companies that have medical scribes. A lot of them pay like 13 or 14 an hour or something like that. They have 327 reviews, 3.7 out of five stars, and 66% recommend working here to a friend, 74% approve of the CEO. So they have pretty solid ratings overall. I don't really think you're gonna get a lot of benefits here. I mean, you can look at them, but as a part-time position, typically you don't get a lot of benefits. And then as far as interviews, what you might expect here is a 2.9 out of five difficulty rating. You can also look and see if they have some questions that were posted for this particular job. You see right here, four people who applied for a medical scribe position actually left some feedback. They gave it a 3.3 out of five rating in terms of difficulty. And then some of the interview questions for this job are, what are one of your strengths and weaknesses? Uh, what are your views on healthcare? Where do you see healthcare technology going in the future? What computer languages do you know? How would you teach the computer languages you know to someone who is a beginner? I don't know why they would ask that. That doesn't really make sense. But um, as far as the other jobs, I think, you know, fairly basic questions for the most part. Hopefully this was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell if you want more daily work from home opportunities like these. And I'll see you in the next video.